everyone. I'm really excited to uh, try and answer these two uh, challenges. So what I'm going to do uh, today, I would like to answer or to answer challenge number eight and ten, which will be create an automation script using uh, Appium and execute the same script on iOS and Android. So that will be uh, number ten. Uh, so how is going to work? So I'm going to use uh, not only Appium but also a BDD. So I'm going to create a standard BDD script that's going to generate an Appium script. I connected between Cucumber, standard Cucumber, and Appium by using the open source uh, testng uh, Cucumber execution. Uh, so the execution manager will be the testng. So I have an Appium script or Appium driver uh, execute by test ng and the test it itself the flow is actually created by the cucumber so let's see what do I have here so I have uh, two tests that I'm about or two scenarios that I'm about to execute it both of them on amtrak.com I'm just uh, going to look for a status of one uh, trend and the other uh, part will be just to uh, buy a ticket or so I'm going to find a ticket between New York and Boston uh, these are the uh, steps of the flow. So we can see here, let's take for example, I'm going to Amtrak, I'm waiting after 20 seconds to buy the ticket, um, to buy a ticket uh, button to appear, and then I'm clicking the button, I'm entering the different uh, stations, New York and uh, Boston, I'll scroll down and press on my uh, find a track button, and then I validate that I get the departure uh, value. Uh, you can see here that I'm using an object repository so when I have here when I click on the uh, trend status you can see this is the object ID so I'm using an XPath to identify all my objects so uh, I have my test I have my object repository and as I mentioned before everything is about to execute by the uh, test ng so I have four tests that I would like to execute on test ng uh, one uh, important thing that I would like to mention here I'm about to run it on Perfecto Mobile Cloud Perfecto Mobile Cloud is um, Appium grid so all I don't have all the devices in my hand I want to run it so I'm going to just uh, use or open the driver uh, and my cloud will be Perfecto Mobile I'm about to run it what you can see here is that I just hit the run button for uh, these are my capability my Appium capability um, and let's see what happened here we can see that one iOS is actually opened and two Android is open and I'm going into Amtrak.com uh, I'm looking for uh, trend status I'm returning back entering the date so this is the script that I just mentioned you can see that I'm looking for a station uh, after I'm finding the, after I'm finding the station I'm going to enter the number of the uh, train which is Oh, number of the bus 45 and validate that I getting the uh, error message in this case is an error message my second test is actually uh, also an interesting test I'm going to uh, this I'm going to the script uh, I'm, I'm going to the uh, arm trucks and looking for a ticket number so you can see here it went all the way and find this uh, departure the script ended on both of the devices that's just actually uh, quite interesting this device is slower the internet is slower so we can see that the test work uh, slower on top of this and I have a standard test uh, everything is uh, connected together so we have BDD we have Appium we have object repository we have four devices in the cloud I think it's a uh, answer and we have Android and iOS which is also very very important it's not just run on Android but on iOS and I think an ans I answered both of the uh, eight and tens uh, days uh, challenge. So I will add more details and uh, some links and code example in a blog post but this is the uh, video and I hope you uh, enjoy this uh, video and blog post. Thank you very much.